welcome. This is Melissa Armour with the Stock Swish and Reviewing Apple. And this looks good today. Um, there's an option for the 450s that you could have got out of yesterday that uh, looks promising here. <coughs> Excuse me. And the day trade today. So let's go over it. Uh, and this lagged into the lunchtime period, but now it's starting to look like it's going to get some traction again into noon. So anyways, perfect timing here. Went long this, ran straight up. You could have got out. If you're in it for the bigger number, it's starting to look like it's going to get some going here again. What does it have to do? I think it has to get over 442-ish. And then that should take us back up to the high, which was around 443 and change. Now, yesterday I called the 440 calls. Didn't quite get there. Three and a half dollars off the number. You could have got out. It was a positive trade, but I really thought it was going to go there. Now, let me just look at the market. I mean, the market is green. I've called no longs in this market, <clears throat> but I think Apple's on its own. I mean, I felt that way the last couple of days, but the question is, is this really going to get the mojo and the momentum here in the next four hours? I, I, think it, I think it can. I'm starting to feel more positive about this going into lunch um, because it's starting to, you know, base out here and look like it might want to break out here into 12 o'clock. We're going to get over 440 again here. Anyways, rainy day in New York, hurricanes across the whole East Coast, nothing to do but trade. Good luck, everyone. If you're interested in the Golden Gap course, email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com. Have a good day.